In this video, we'll walk you through how to pick the correct sizing for Torrid, Bisp, and Copperfield jackets, pullovers, shirts, and pants. We'll cover how to take necessary body measurements, give you suggestions and tips we typically recommend to our customers, and look at our sizing charts to help you figure out what size to ultimately select. The first part of this video will be dedicated to jacket and shirt sizing, and the second part of this video will be focused on pants. In order to get the most out of this video, you'll need a piece of paper, a pen, and a soft tape measure. A piece of string or a shoelace that you can compare to a nearby ruler will also work. While collecting measurements can be done by yourself, it is perhaps a bit easier with the help of a friend. As we walk through the various measurements, feel free to pause this video as needed. Note that the measurement process is the same for both men and women. For best results, measure more than once and wear relatively form-fitting clothes. In order to help select the correct sizing for our jackets, pullovers, and shirts, we'll need to measure the following four areas. Sleeves, chest, waist, and hips. The first measurement we'll be taking is sleeve length. In order to get an accurate number, start by finding the knobby C7 vertebrae on the back of your neck. Hold one end of the measuring tape on that spot, bring the measuring tape across the top of the shoulder and down the arm below your wrist. As the measuring tape hangs limp, look at the spot where your wrist starts and jot that measurement down. Note that your arm should lay naturally at your side while you are taking this measurement. Next up is your chest measurement. Start by finding the widest part of your chest. Typically, this is just under your arms and across the shoulder blades. Standing up straight and in a relaxed manner, wrap the measuring tape around this part of your body and read the measurement. Note that the measuring tape should be snug but not tight with around one finger width of space between yourself and the measuring tape. While taking your measurements, make sure the measuring tape is parallel to the ground. Once you've written down your chest measurement, next up is your waist. Start by finding the narrowest part of your waist. Typically, this is a little bit above the top of your pants. Wrap the measuring tape around your waist and read the measurement. Just as with the chest measurement, make sure that the measuring tape is snug but not tight. Last up is your hips. This measurement should be taken at the widest part of your lower half. With your feet together, wrap the measuring tape around your hips and jot down the number of inches. As with the two previous measurements, make sure it's not too tight. Now that you've gotten your four main measurements, it's time to take a look at the sizing chart. If you want to view this on our website, go to enlightenedequipment.com, click on the product you're interested in purchasing, scroll down, and click the Fit and Sizing tab. Start by checking where your measurements fit within the sizing chart. If your numbers all fit nicely into one sizing category, you're probably set to order that size. If your numbers fit at the top of the sizing category, size up for a roomier fit. If your numbers are at the bottom of the sizing category, size down for a more athletic fit. All in light equipment apparel is constructed a half size large to naturally accommodate layering. Find your measurements landing in a couple of different size categories. Focus on the widest part of your body. If that's your hips, choose your sizing based on that. If that's your chest, choose your size category that fits your chest measurements. If your sleeve length is the outlier, still make your decision based on the widest part of your body. Over 6'2 or have a particularly long torso? Consider selecting the custom option of a tall torso. This adds two inches in length to the torso and one inch in length to each sleeve. Plan on wearing your EE apparel with a biking or a climbing helmet? Consider selecting the custom option of a helmet compatible hood. Custom Torrid jackets and Torrid pullovers can come with or without a hood. Torrid jackets and pullovers were designed to fit under a similarly sized Visp rain jacket or Copperfield windshirt. Questions? Reach out to us at customer service at inlinedequipment.com with your measurements. Looking to find the right sizing for your Torrid, Bisp, or Copperfield pants? This portion of the video will walk you through how to collect your measurements and pick the right size pants. In order to help you in this process, we'll be walking you through how to measure your waist, hips, and inseam. First off, your waist. Standing up straight and in a relaxed manner, wrap your measuring tape around the narrowest part of your waist and read the measurement. Make sure the measuring tape is parallel to the ground and snug but not tight with around one finger width of space between yourself and the measuring tape. Next, you'll be measuring your hips. With your feet together, wrap the measuring tape around the widest part of your hips and record the measurement. Just as with the waist measurement, make sure that the measuring tape is snug but not tight. Lastly, you'll need to determine the length of your inseam. Find your inner ankle bone on the inside of your leg and hold one end of your measuring tape to that spot. Then bring the other end along the inside of your leg to your crotch. 
make sure your leg is straight and not bent as this will ensure an accurate measurement. Once you've got those three measurements, it's time to look at the sizing chart. If you want to view this on our website, once again, go to enlightenedequipment.com, click on the product you're interested in purchasing, scroll down and click the fit and sizing tab. If your waist and hip measurements fall into the same sizing category, you can feel fairly confident that you've got the right size. If your measurements fall into two categories, make your decision based on the widest part of your body. When you go to make your order, input the size you just determined from your waist and hip measurements along with your inseam measurements. Note that all of our pants are a bit oversized to allow for layering and ease of movement. Hopefully this video has been helpful in making you feel more comfortable and confident in determining the correct sizes for enlightened equipment apparel. As all bodies are different, if you have any further questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to us directly via email, phone, or chat.